This is Darius from therabbitpad.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Make a Table feature in Google Sheets. Google Sheets has this feature where it will take your data and your spreadsheet like it's presented here, and then it will automatically format the table to make it more visually appealing, and that is called inserting a table. How you get there is you go to Insert, and then you select Tables. From here, you can choose from templates. So if you haven't started making your table yet, you can use these as templates to start your work. And there's lots of templates here for a variety of needs. But if you have an existing table that you want to convert to a table, you can do that by highlighting your data, then right-clicking, then selecting convert to table. When you do that, Google Sheets will convert it to a table that looks like this. And from here, you can change some of the parameters or settings. So you can click on this down arrow to rename your table, to adjust the table range. So if your table is going to extend to like row 20, you can change that here. You can also turn off alternating colors or turn them back on. You can also customize your table colors here by selecting some predetermined colors or creating or choosing a custom color. If you don't want the table anymore, you can revert back to unformatted data and you can also delete the table in its entirety. In addition to making the table visually appealing, Google Sheets also puts in filters so that you can sort your data, you can filter your data and things like that. So say for instance, I want to put the list of my fruit in alphabetical order. I click on this down arrow, then I select sort to column, then I can sort from A to Z or from Z to A. And then that adjusts all of the data in the spreadsheet to correspond to the alphabetical order of the fruit. So this is just a basic getting started video on how to use Google's create a table feature in Google Sheets. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel to view more helpful videos in the future. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.